Okay, so in this question, we're considering a mass M hinged to the ceiling by a rod that can swing freely about a hinge. We're told a particle of mass little m strikes the ball horizontally at speed u and then sticks to the ball. What is the maximum height reached by m? So let's draw the scenario before the ball strikes. So you have the rod and the mass m here hanging freely downwards. And we have another mass little m traveling horizontally at speed u and it's going to strike it. Well, we're then told they join up, so they coalesce. So we're going to have another particle of mass m plus little m and that's going to have some speed v. So that that's going to swing upwards like this to some height. And the difference in height there is going to be the maximum height reach. Now, we need to find that. So let's first of all find V. So by conservation of momentum, the momentum before mu must be equal to the momentum after that, m plus little m times V. And that tells us that the speed they're going to move off at will be equal to mu over capital M plus little m. Now, for it to reach the maximum height, we want to presume that all the kinetic energy it has when it's at this point here, the speed v, is converted entirely into potential energy up here. So that tells us that m plus m, their combined mass, g times the height they move through, will be equal to one half times their mass times their speed squared. Well, that's m u over m plus little m all squared. Well, then we see if we cancel off here, and divide through by g to over here. This tells us the height it's going to reach, h, will be 1 over 2g times mu over capital M plus little m all squared. So that should be a little m on top. So that tells us that our answer is going to be 